Hello everyone and welcome back to CJ Explores. This week we're on the Gold Coast and we're going to show you what you can do in one day in Burley Heads. So it's Sunday morning here and it's so busy on the beach. I reckon there's a few surf life saving clubs on with the kids. We had a storm yesterday so I think everyone's taking advantage of the good weather. Okay, so Burley Heads is super popular with swimmers and surfers alike. The way that the land lies, we've got a headland on the right hand side and that serves as like a little protection for the cove. So you get some pretty safe uh, swimming and surf breaks there. And basically the beach just stretches all the way up the left to surfers in Southport. Just across from the beach you have this nice grassy parkland area and then you have all the cafes and restaurants. And we're going to head there now and try and find some lunch. <laughs> okay, so we went with two vegan Nutella acai bowls and I'm very excited. We've picked a little spot to have our acai bowls and Justin's Park is just back from the main beach where the surf lifeguards are. I think on Sundays they used to do a fire and drumming circles here. Not sure if they still do that. In the evenings. Um, but yeah, it, it's a little bit of a, um, I guess a community hub where everyone comes down and does uh, community events and stuff. So. Yeah, there's probably other stuff that goes on here. Not sure if the fire circles and the drumming still go on, but time for lunch. I'm very excited. I love smoothie bowls. And we've got... This one's a vegan Nutella. So I think it'd be a little bit yummier than just normal like cacao ones. And you have like a chocolate protein and some granola mix and nuts. And it is very delicious. Yeah, I'm well Perfect excited for this. Perfect for a hot day. Yum, yum. Okay, we've finished up our acai bowls now for lunch and we're going to head to the beach. It's very, very warm and we're going to try and catch some waves. Okay, so Burley Heads is a pretty safe beach to swim at. Um, I'm sure they have shark nets to stop sharks getting in, though there have been shark attacks uh, along this stretch of coastline. Um, the other thing they do is they have seaplanes and helicopters and drones which I think also keep an eye out for sharks and stuff but it's pretty well patrolled and I think if you swim along here you're probably going to be okay. Okay, we're all done at the beach now, what's next? The National Park. Yeah, National Park, which is the headland. Uh, just up there. We have parked up at the top of the Burley Heads car parking area, actually here on the street road, which we believe is free parking. Um, down here is a place to be if you want to find accommodation in Burley. It's just all overlooking the beachfront, it's really nice. Right now though, we're going to continue walking up this hill that we're parked on and go and visit the National Park. Okay, so Burley Heads National Park, you actually have the option of walking around it or you can go over it. But either way, you'll end up on Tully Budgera Creek and that gives you a viewpoint all the way down to Coolangatta and Kira and uh, New South Wales actually. Okay, now we are in the Burley Heads National Park and I think we're going to try and head to the top where there might be a lookout we'll be able to see south and then north all the way up to the surface. First stop on this national park walk is this little spot here. You can see all down the beach across the coast and then down to surface paradise. There's a little bench here which Corey is climbing on and you can just watch the waves rolling in, watch the surfers or I think this would be a great spot to watch the sunrise um, in the mornings. It's very nice. We've made it to the top, we are now at the lookout and it's pretty amazing. Corey is up here doing some drone shots where you can see all the way down the beach to Kulangata. 
It is very nice here. Woohoo! Okay guys, that's where we're going to leave you today. We hope you enjoyed your little adventure around Burley Heads. Uh, we'll see you next week with another adventure from somewhere around southeast Queensland. Bye! Bye.